friends and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Jillian and today as you guys can see from the title it is going to be a Dollar Tree haul and it is a pretty large Dollar Tree haul so I'm going to try to get through this really quickly because I know I can ramble on and I talk a lot. So a lot of this stuff is Christmas stuff, random items, a few things are like stocking stuffers for the kids and my dog and then also gifts for like teachers. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you everything that I picked up. It's not in order. I literally just dumped everything out of the bag on my sofa so I can show you guys. So I'm gonna show you guys some wrapping paper first that I picked up. So the first roll of wrapping paper is this one and these are all by Hallmark. So I grabbed this one with the red truck just because I thought it was so cute. And this one comes with quite a lot of wrapping paper. You're gonna see the other wrapping paper that I got, it's very um, small amounts, but this one comes with a decent um, amount, but I thought that was really cute with all of the red trucks. And then if you watched one of my previous Dollar Tree hauls, I did show you guys, I got the Elf Christmas wrapping paper, and this is also by Hallmark. But if you guys can see, I don't know if you guys can tell, but there's not much wrapping paper in it. So I did go ahead and grab another roll just because I really love this Christmas movie. So I grabbed another roll of that one. And then the last roll of wrapping paper that I got is this Crayola one, which is what I will wrap the kids' presents in. And it's just a bunch of Crayola crayons and Christmas trees. And I just thought that was really cute. So I grabbed a roll of this one as well. So sticking with Christmas, I'm going to try to show you guys all the Christmas stuff first. I also got some greenery. So I got this little Christmas box I'm about to show you guys that I want to put in my bedroom. I'm going to decorate my bedroom just a little bit, just a few touches of Christmas. And I thought this was really cute. So it's just greenery with all of these white little balls and it has glitter on it. The only thing I hate is um, how much the glitter falls off, but I just thought it was really cute. So I grabbed two of them because I thought they were so pretty. So I grabbed two of those. And then I also grabbed two of these white flowers so I can combine them all together. And this also has glitter in the center. And I thought these are really pretty. So I grabbed two of these as well. And this is the box that I'm gonna put it in. I thought this box was really cute. You can use it as decor or you can put like a Christmas gift in it, but I'm gonna use it for decor and it just says, may your Christmas be merry and bright. And I thought it was really cute with the Christmas tree and a little camper. That's how it looks. And I plan on putting it in here and then using it as um, decoration for my bedroom. Obviously I'll make it look a little more prettier than that, but that's the plan. The next two Christmas items that I found that I thought were really pretty, I have no clue where I'm gonna put it or what I'm gonna do with it, but I didn't see this last year, so I did pick it up. And this one is gold and it just says it's a core, so, and it's nine feet, but they're little acorns. And this one's silver, this one's gold. So my plan is to maybe find a mini candle. I know I have a few mini candles um, and see if they fit in the center. If not, I'll figure out where to put it, but I just thought it was really cute and they're both nine feet. So I had also showed this in a previous Dollar Tree haul and I picked up three more of them because I thought they were so cute. So they are just these snowmen little mugs. And I originally picked up three more because my plan was to give it to the kids' teachers as like a Christmas gift. I was gonna make them like a little basket and this is one of the items that I was gonna put in their baskets, but you're gonna see I found other mugs that I think I'm just gonna give them the other mugs and then maybe I'll give these to like family and friends. Um, I did buy one other one that I did end up keeping and then I think I'm gonna give these to like family and friends just because I'm gonna show you guys these mugs that I found that I plan on giving to the teachers. I've never seen these at my Dollar Tree but I did grab three of them and it says best teacher ever with a little apple and they are just little mugs. And like I said, I did grab two. I mean not two, I grabbed three and it has it on both sides. My daughter has two teachers and then my son has one, so that's why I grabbed three. So I think I'm gonna give them um, these mugs just because I thought they were super cute. Next item is going to be this really cute basket. So I did only buy one because I do wanna test it out. So I thought this would be really cute for the kids' teachers. Like I said, I was planning on making them a basket, but I wanna test it out and see how it comes out first. So my plan was to put the mug in here. I usually give them like a gift card, stick in the gift card in the mug. I also got these, I'll show you in a second, that I was planning to put in the basket as well. And then maybe some like um, chocolate or snacks in here. So I only got one basket, like I said, I wanna test it out and see how it turns out. Um, and then I got these, which I'll show you guys next just because I did show you guys really quickly. But these are by the brand Jot and they are sticky notes. And when you open it, it has 
little sticky notes here and here. And then it has Velcro where they can close it shut. And I think that's so pretty. It has a bunch of flowers all over it. So I did grab three. Like I said, Madison has two teachers. Ryan has one. And this is what I planned on also putting in their basket. Christmas item I have is this one. I thought I picked this up last year, but I didn't. So this was literally the only one left. This part is hanging off. So I'll have to fix that. I can just wrap it around. There we go. It's fixed. Um, so yeah, I thought this was really cute. So I'm going to put this somewhere in the house. I've already started decorating for Christmas, but I'll find a spot for this cute little red truck. I just thought that this was too cute to pass up. So next few items are going to be stockings. And I was so excited to find these stockings. I've never seen these stockings at my Dollar Tree. This is the first year that I found them and I did grab five. I feel like our stockings that we've had are super old. So I figured I'll just grab some new stockings. I needed to grab an extra one this year for our puppy. So I grabbed, how many? I think I grabbed two of these like little camper ones. And look how cute, it has a Christmas tree on top. I just loved the way this looks. Um, my plan is to hang letters on top of each one so we know whose stocking is who. From Target, I got these little wooden letters and I got the first letter of all of our names and I'm gonna hang that right above here. So I got two of the camper ones and then I got three of the red truck with the Christmas tree. I just think these are so cute and for a dollar why not i usually try not to buy too many stocking stuffers for everyone so i think these are like a perfect size to hang above our fireplace so three um of the truck ones and then two of the camper ones it'll be i don't know maybe i'll give the kids the camper ones and then me the puppy and robert will get the truck one i'm not sure but i just thought this was really cute if you guys find this in your dollar tree definitely grab them Next is going to be some more fuzzy socks. You guys know I love to buy socks from Dollar Tree and this is just a pair of gingerbread, super soft um, socks. These are a little more high top than the other ones that I bought. The other ones were more like the ankle. These go up a little bit higher, but these are super soft and comfortable. I also picked up some Christmas cards. I used to always give out Christmas cards and mail them out and the past like two years I haven't. So this year I'm gonna go ahead and mail out some Christmas cards. I'll also give some to the kids' teachers. So. This one comes with 14 and this one comes with six. This one is just the famous red truck. I grabbed a pack of that and then I grabbed a pack of these and these say season's greeting with a cute little reindeer. So I'll be sending out Christmas cards this year as well as giving them out to the kids teachers. Next, I grabbed two packs of little um, gift tags. I'm not sure how many I have left from last year. So I only picked up two. This one comes with eight. And these are the sticker ones and then these come with 20 and it's like the design on all these and these are the ones that you hang on the gifts and i just really liked how these look so i grabbed these two packs then i also grabbed these two little tins and i think these are so cute um dollar tree always comes out with these every year and how cute is this this is supposed to be like a little mailbox and it also has that little flag that moves so and you can put gifts in there so i grabbed two i grabbed this one and then i also grabbed this one again with the red trucks super cute and then the flag goes up so yeah i thought these were really cute so i grabbed these two i also grabbed a, a few bags i only grabbed four again i do have to take down my christmas box and see what kind of wrapping paper and gift bags i have left over from last year but I just thought these were cute. So I grabbed this one that says Merry Christmas with a truck on it. Obviously I love the whole truck theme, but grabbed this one. Then I also grabbed this one that has a red truck. These are both the same size. They're like a medium size bag. Then I also got this one with a snowman that says Happy Holidays. And then this one I thought for the kids would be really cute. I don't know um, who I'll give this to, but for either of the kids, I thought this would be cute. And this one says Norwell Noel. And I thought that was, like I said, super cute. So grabbed that. And I also grabbed a pack of gift boxes and it comes with three different designs. So one of the designs is the red truck, the cute little camper. And then the third design is a wagon with a Christmas tree in it. You guys can see it's super cute. So and this is more of like the smaller size box. Next two items are gonna be these two packs of LED lights and they are snowflakes. So. I'm gonna let Ryan decorate his room a little bit this year for Christmas. And I figured this would be really cute if we drape over his bed. I grabbed two packs, cause I feel like one pack will not be enough. So I grabbed two packs of these snowflake lights to drape over his bed. Then I also to decorate his room, I got this DIY LED paper house and it says candy shop. 
and then there's a little tea light candle inside and then the little house will light up and i thought this would be really cute to either put on his dresser or on his nightstand to make his room look really cute and festive so i grabbed that and then i think this is the last christmas item i grabbed but i have been on a hunt for this red truck ribbon i could not find it in any of my dollar trees and i had luck this was the very last roll or would have grabbed more and i think this is really cute to like decorate around the house or wrap gifts in i just think it's really cute and this comes with nine feet all right, guys, and the last few items is literally going to be just random things that I found that I picked up. A few of them are going to be like stocking stuffers. So the first stocking stuffer is for Ryan, and it's a puzzle. He's been getting more into puzzles, so I figured I can put this Toy Story puzzle in there. It is 48 pieces, and he does like Toy Story, so that's why I grabbed him this one. Then for a stocking stuffer for my puppy, I grabbed her a few toys as well. So I got her two pink toys. This one says hashtag loved and then this little pink one and I'm not going to squeeze it or my dog's going to come running but they do have like a squeaker inside that makes noises so I grabbed her those two and then I also grabbed her a um, little pizza squeaker and these will go in her stocking. A stocking stuffer for Madison is just this little Disney little squishy. She likes stuff like this and this is like a little elephant. Yeah, I think that's an elephant. So grabbed her that for her stocking. I also picked up Madison for her stocking at this little doll. She actually was with me when I picked these up and she grabbed this on her own and she was playing with the hair and stuff and she really liked it. So I went ahead and I bought it for her and I'm gonna put it in her stocking and the little dress has a bunch of cute bunnies. So I grabbed her this doll. Next few things are gonna be stocking stuffers for Ryan. And the first thing are these two little science kits. I thought they were super cute. Obviously I will do this with Ryan. Um, I won't let him do it alone, but it says for ages six plus. This one is a rocket blast. And that's how that one looks. And then this one is a volcano science exploding um, little science kits. So I grabbed those two to put in his stocking. Then I also found this and I thought it was really cool. It's by Hot Wheels. And I guess it's an app. You find the app, you download the app, and then you can race the cars. I don't know. It has instructions back here. But I've never seen this and I thought that was really cool. And that's how the car looks like. So I figured that would be a really cool um, little stocking stuffer gift for Ryan. Another stocking stuffer for Ryan is this LED projector light. And I'm so mad. I grabbed, they had one, a Christmas one, and I grabbed it. And I don't know where it is. I don't know if the lady forgot to put it in my bag, but it's not my bag. So I only have the dinosaur one with me right now. Maybe I'll find it somewhere in my car, but it's a little LED projector light. I don't know how well it'll work. It was only a dollar, but he loves dinosaurs. And I just thought that was really cute. So this is random, but I told Ryan to write a list of things that he wanted like for gifts and for stocking stuffers. And on the list of stocking stuffers, he said he wanted a stapler. I'm pretty sure he asked for a stapler just because he makes a lot of comics and he likes to staple his comics together. So I just grabbed him a blue stapler to put in his stocking. And then this is for both of the kids. I thought these were super cute. I've never seen these and they are called brush buddies. So they are pop-up um, toothbrushes. So I grabbed Ryan this blue elephant one and then I grabbed Madison this little cow one and it's so cute. So there's a little button there and when you press the button, the toothbrush pops up and I thought that was really cute. A great stocking stuffer gift idea. Another stocking stuffer for Ryan is Jurassic World um, markers. He has the crayon set and he just loves Jurassic World and Jurassic Park. So I thought that was a cute um, stocking stuffer gift idea and then I also bought him these dinosaurs and they are super cute I know I've said cute a lot in this haul but look how cute this is it's a little baby blue dinosaur don't ask me what kind of dinosaur this is I have no clue but I got him a blue one and then I got him a green one yeah they're the same type of dinosaur but just different color to decorate his room like i've said we are transforming his room all into dinosaurs and little by little we are picking up a lot of um cute dinosaur items so for a dollar i grabbed him two of them they did have one more it was pink there was only one more and i would have grabbed it for him but the tail was um broken so i did not get it so then i grabbed ryan these two face masks they're both um jurassic world they are two different colors and designs and we just can't have too many masks these days so i grabbed him these two these aren't going to be like these stocking stuffer i'm going to give it to him now so he can wear it to school but i thought i would show you guys they have a lot of different um masks at dollar tree if you guys are looking for some for yourself or your kids they have a lot of cute girl ones 
Madison won't keep a mask on. She doesn't have to wear one to school, but Ryan does. So into my see cute masks, I always grab them. Then I picked up two packs of these diamond nail filers. So I was um, in need of some new nail filers. So I grabbed a pack for me, but then I grabbed an extra pack because I might give it to my sister or my mom. I'm not sure. I like picking up um, extra knickknacks like this for like friends and family. So anytime I need gifts, I like to make like a lot of baskets. And I think this is a cute little um, stocking stuffer or just like knickknack for a loved one. And then I also picked up this Sassy Chick electronic nail kit. So I thought this would be good for when I wear these fake nails. Sometimes the glue gets stuck to my nails. So it's good to like file it off or when I'm doing like the dip or gel nails, I have to file my nails down. So I wanna try that out. It comes with three different um, little screws, whatever these are called. So we'll test that out, see how that works. And then I also found this by Flower in the color Life is a Peach and it's just like a crayon lip color. I thought that looked like a pretty color. So I'm gonna try that out. The last few things is gonna be for Madison. They're all a bunch of like hair clips, except this one. This one's an elastic. I thought was really cute. It's black with a bunch of large and small pearls. And then I found all of these little hair clips that I thought were adorable and I could not pass up. I grabbed one of each. Um, so I grabbed this one. This one is strawberries. And if you guys, I don't know if you guys can see, but it has glitter and the glitter like falls over. It just moves around. So I grabbed a pack of the strawberry ones. Then they had a watermelon one. They all have like that glitter inside that moves around. I grabbed her a grape one, a lemon one. And then the last one was a pineapple one. And they all obviously come with two. And I thought that was super cute. So I grabbed her that. And then the last thing I got is just this clear basket because my dog's treats are just on top of my pantry and they're falling over. So I just needed something to store all of her treats in. So I just grabbed this clear one. All right friends, so that is going to end my Dollar Tree haul. I really hope you guys are enjoying all of my holiday videos and like shopping videos and hauls. I do plan on filming a Walmart shop with me soon, like a Christmas shop with me. And then if I buy anything, I will do like a mini haul at the end. But I hope you guys are enjoying all of these holiday festive videos. If you are, remember to give my video a thumbs up and also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you have not already. I would love for you to be a part of my YouTube family. Stay safe. I love you guys and I will see you guys next time. Bye.